so you're not fighting the 5G and the Wi-Fi on game day that you have it either in your wallet or pulled up before you get here, so it'd be on your phone. But then if I have no bag, I don't have to clear my pockets. These are the new mags. You can see they're different than the ones you just have to walk through. But you literally just walk through, and that's it. Get registered there that I'm good to go. I'm in. And that's, that's it. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty quick. Yeah, and then I can show you with the clear bag, I think. You got the clear bag? The clear bag? Yeah. So that was with a uh, ticket in my wallet, so the RFID ticket. So again, clear bag, got the items in here, have my phone ready, I'll just hold it in front of me as I walk through. Same thing, no false positive, check me, I'm good. Walk up here, now I have the barcode, not the RFID. Underneath there, and it's done. So there will be a sign on here, if you have the RFID, taps here, the barcode goes here, but you saw both of them go fast. So really, we think that the, the just with any change, obviously, fans are going to have to learn, especially now that they're in control of the scanning. So we're going to have a lot of customer service staff out here the first game to help walk fans through, keep an eye on what they're doing, point them in the right direction. But as the games go on, you can see once you know how to do this, lightning fast. Yep. So. Self-service is kind of where, the, where it's headed, kind of. Like yep. You still have people out here, but obviously. Yep, self-service, contactless, you know, you don't have somebody up, like, it's not even so much touching your phone, but just people in close, like trying to scan your ticket. Gotcha. Everybody can spread out now, keep an eye on it, instruct you from here. All those things that fans are going to be looking for, especially right now. Um, we feel like this accomplishes all of that. How many of you fed up for the I thought I was, like I said, I'm sorry, I was late, but how many yep. of these yeah. So these new Macs are only going to be in the southwest gate because this is our highest traffic gate. Right. We're going to evaluate them and see if we want to expand later on. Uh, overall, through the whole stadium, we have 70 mags and 70 of these split up amongst all our gates. And so, what, you know, we, it's the same amount of mags that we've had in the past, but we've now got one of these per every mag. So every single entrance that comes in will have a dedicated ticket pedestal for it. So you won't have to, you know, navigate. You'll just easily just walk through. There'll be one right in front of you. And that's it. The process is the same for students. The process is the same for the students, okay. yeah. They're in the southeast gate. Also, they have They enter, well, they should. They, yes, they can, we, this, they will valid scan anywhere, but their section is there, all the support that we have for their ticketing is there. Um, that's the best place for them to go, so they'll come in there. We actually did a video with, a student filmed it, of exactly this process for the students. So knowing, again, there's so many new students that are gonna be coming to games for the first time, that explains the clear bag, what you do when you get here, go to the southeast gate, go on the stairs here, uh, and it'll run on the campus closed circuit TV, and we'll also send it via social and send it to them by email. So hopefully get the students educated and in here quick. It's definitely looks a lot better. Yeah, good for Hopefully it delivers. Yeah. <laughs>